The Scott Monument is a Victorian Gothic monument to Scottish author Sir Walter Scott. It is the second largest monument to a writer in the world. The tower is 206 inches high and has viewing platforms reached by a series of spiral staircases giving panoramic views of central Edinburgh and its surroundings. The highest platform is reached by a total of 287 steps. The monument was built from sandstone, quarried in West Lothian, and it stands in Princess Street Gardens. Princess Street Gardens are two adjacent public parks in the centre of Edinburgh, Scotland, lying in the shadow of Edinburgh Castle. The gardens were created in the 1820s following the long draining of Nor Loch and building of the new town, beginning in the 1760s. The loch, situated on the north side of town, was originally an artificial creation, forming part of the castle's medieval defences, and this made expansion northwards difficult. The water was polluted from sewage, draining downhill from the old town. The Princess Gardens are the best known parks in Edinburgh, having the highest visitor figures for both residents and visitors to the city. The gardens run along the south side of Princess Street and are divided by the mound, on which the National Gallery of Scotland and the Royal Scottish Academy buildings are located. East Princess Street Gardens run from the mound to Waverley Bridge and cover 8.5 acres the larger Princess Street Gardens cover 29 acres and extend to the adjacent church of St John's and St Cuthbert's. The Church of St Cuthbert is a parish church of the Church of Scotland. Properly founded in the 17th century, the church once covered an extensive parish around Edinburgh. The church current buildings was designed and completed in 1894. St Cuthbert's is situated within a large churchyard that bounds Princess Street Gardens and Lovian Road. A church was probably founded on this site during or shortly after the life of Cuthbert. The church is first recorded in 1128 when David I granted it to Holyrood Abbey. St Cuthbert's became a Protestant church at the Scottish Reformation in 1560. From after the Reformation until the 19th century, the church was usually called West Kirk. The church's position at the foot of Castle Rock saw it damaged or destroyed at least four times between the 14th and 17th centuries. The buildings of Scotland's Guide to Edinburgh calls the church's furnishings extraordinary. Features include stained glass windows by Lewis Comfort Tiffany, Douglas Strachan and Ballantyne and Gardner mural paintings by Gerald Moyer and John Duncan, and memorials by John Flaxman and George Frampton. The church also possesses a ring of ten bells by Taylor of Loughborough. The church has been a Category A listed building since 1970.